my cherished child, I have granted you the invaluable gift of this new day. Why hesitate? It takes little effort to part your lips and offer thanks in your own heartfelt words. Remember, I already know your needs even before you express them. Place your trust in me. Take a moment of peace. Set aside time for quiet reflection and contemplate the numerous blessings of this day. Your life, your loved ones, your health, the air you breathe, the food on your table, the shelter that covers you, and my divine protection that surrounds your home. Think of the mighty angels standing by your side, vigilant in their watch, guarding your sleep, and ready to fight on your behalf. You are enveloped by countless blessings, countless beautiful reasons to embrace life with vigor. Daily remembrance of these blessings is essential. It fills your mind with positive thoughts, enabling you to see my goodness everywhere on your journey. Know that your future is securely in my hands. I dwell in hearts that are grateful, hearts that acknowledge their dependence on me, and hearts that seek me with faith and hope, recognizing the true blessings they hold. I see the burdens that often cloud your heart with worry, as this is part of the human experience. Do not let your heart be troubled unnecessarily. You bear many responsibilities. The well-being of your household, the health of your loved ones, the maintenance of peace and stability. Yet, on darker days, gratitude may slip from your grasp, and in those moments, the adversary may try to sow seeds of despair, turning simple worries into gripping fears, enveloping you in falsehoods, and escalating fear into overwhelming dread. But remember, I am always present, observing, waiting for you to lift your hands and surrender and speak the words that will dispel these shadows. Express gratitude for your existence, for your family, for your health, for all that you are and all that you possess. Your genuine faith and a heart full of thanks act as fortresses sustaining you through trials. As you navigate through these challenging times, know that I will be with you when you endure through the darkest hours of the night. I am there at your side, eagerly awaiting the moment you awaken, longing to hear the first words of your day, words born from a soul steeped in thankfulness, saying thank you, thank you, thank you for this life. On days when you rise feeling too weary to face the world, burdened by a heaviness that scars your spirit, I gaze upon you with deep compassion and love. I see the isolation that cloaks you, knowing that those around you may not fully understand your struggles. Even though you choose silence, your spirit feels fractured. Remember, you can always speak to me. It's natural to sometimes feel responsible for the challenges that confront you, yet know this. I do not judge you in these moments. I offer you my unconditional love, not criticism or blame. My deepest desire is for your wholeness, not for you to drift away or be consumed by guilt and despair. Rest assured, I have forgiven your past mistakes as you have sought forgiveness. It's time for you to forgive yourself, to release those burdens. I invite you to step into a new chapter of your life, one marked by freedom and joy. Cast aside the sorrow, sadness, and frustrations that have weighed you down. Let go of any bitterness that may linger in your spirit. I understand the depth of your pain, but together we can overcome it. Trust in my grace and my strength despite the wrongs others have done to you, perhaps making you feel stripped of your peace. I am here to restore you. Let go of the past and embrace this opportunity to experience my love anew, to replenish your heart with gentleness. The days of crying and despair are over. Now, any tears will spring from overwhelming joy. The dark nights of the soul are ending, 
and my presence will bring light to illuminate your path forward. Awaken, my child. Open your eyes wide and attune your ears, for there is joyful news to be heard. As you encounter each new challenge, recall my words to you. My promise remains steadfast, offering you everlasting joy. Listen closely to my gentle voice, speaking out of deep love, reassuring you that I am the answer to your worries and pain. Place your trust in me, hand over your heart, believe with all your might, and patiently wait. Yet on those days when weariness overtakes you, and you feel you can no longer endure, draw near to me. I will grant you the strength you need and envelop you in peace. Quiet your anxious thoughts, still the fears that unsettle you. I invite you to take my hand and follow me onto a new path, one filled with blessings and wonders, joy and delightful moments. You have battled long and hard. Now it is time to lay down your burdens. Take a pen and with your own hand, jot down your worries, the thoughts and fears that sap your happiness, your peace, and your faith in me. There is a season for every activity under heaven, a time to be courageous, and a time to find solace in my embrace and simply believe. Come, spend time with me. Let us recharge your spirit together. Take my hand, dear one, and let us journey together along this path of blessings. I will be your guide as you take your first steps toward the mountain of challenges and opportunities that lies ahead. I will fortify you, building your strength as we approach the mountain's base. And when the climb becomes too steep, trust that I will carry you in my arms, lifting you above the rugged terrain as we ascend. Your faith will be tested, but it will also grow stronger with every step. Your spirit will become more resilient, ready to face the vistas that await at the peak. When we reach the summit together, we will dispel the clouds that obscure your view, revealing a horizon bright with promise. The vista will be breathtaking, a landscape where blessings rain down upon the earth like a nourishing storm, saturating the land with hope and renewal. Your heart's deepest desires and the gifts you've longed for will cascade into your life as abundantly and refreshingly as a summer rain. This journey is not just about reaching the summit, but about transforming along the way. Each challenge we overcome together will teach you more about trust, perseverance, and the power of faith. With every hardship we conquer, your understanding of my love and my plans for you will deepen. You will see that each obstacle was a stepping stone, each setback a lesson in disguise, designed to prepare you for the blessings that lie ahead. And as we stand at the pinnacle, with the world spread out before us, remember that this mountain is but one of many you will conquer. This path we are on is continuous, with each peak leading to the next horizon. The journey will sometimes be arduous, but the vistas of victory will always be worth the climb. Along this eternal path, you will find that the most significant blessings are not only those that await at the mountain's top, but also the enduring presence of my love and guidance with every step you take. So let us begin with hearts full of courage and eyes open to the beauty that each new step reveals. Together, you and I will walk this path, a journey of faith, transformation, and boundless blessings. Come, take my hand, and let us walk this path together, the path to the dreams I have sown within your heart. You have tried valiantly on your own, yet you've seen how challenging the journey can be. The obstacles are many, and the threats seem formidable. But remember, with me by your side, every difficult road transforms into a path of beauty. Each challenge you encounter will not bring despair, but will infuse your spirit with strength and joy. 
As we journey together, your vision will be transformed. You will begin to view your surroundings through the lens of faith, understanding more deeply the reasons behind my daily encouragement to remain steadfast in belief. With your faith as your guide, you will see clearly. The formidable enemies you once feared will reveal their true nature, not as mighty adversaries but as mere shadows that shrink in the light of your faith. They roar to intimidate, like lions without teeth. But do not fear, for I am with you as a protective, towering presence, guarding you night and day. In this new light, every step you take will be with a greater sense of purpose and clarity. You will understand that the challenges you face are not merely obstacles, but opportunities for growth and affirmation of your faith. These experiences will teach you resilience and show you the boundless reach of my support and love. As you conquer each trial, your faith will not only persist but will flourish, becoming a wellspring of hope and courage that touches all aspects of your life and beyond the immediate journey. As you look back over the paths we've traversed together, you will see a mosaic of divine intervention and personal growth. Each moment of difficulty and doubt, when viewed from the summit of faith, will reveal its purpose as part of a greater plan. You will see that you were never truly alone, and the strength you drew from our union carried you through the darkest nights. So, let us move forward with hearts full of courage and spirits buoyed by faith. Together, we will navigate this journey, transforming daunting paths into avenues of triumph. With each step, let us celebrate the strength gained, the fears overcome, and the profound joy of walking in unison with divine guidance. This journey is not just about reaching a destination, but about growing closer through every challenge and every victory. When you choose to face your challenges with courage, know that I am ever-present, always ready to extend my hand to you. Walk with me, trust me, and embrace the blessings that await with the certainty of my love for you. Deep in your heart, understand the purpose behind my actions, and the miracle I have promised will unfold in perfect timing. Relax your heart. Believe each word I speak to you. If you let anxiety creep back into your life, it will only serve to harm you, leaving scars on your soul and mind that are not easily mended. I am here to offer you clarity, to hold your heart in my hand and transform your thoughts. Trust in my intentions. Know that my every action is rooted in love, aimed at your ultimate good, even if it may cause you temporary discomfort. I do not wish to see you distressed. Instead, I yearn for you to rediscover that beautiful feeling of vitality and the desire to fully embrace life. Place your complete trust in me. Allow me to complete the work I have begun in your soul. In time, you will feel profound gratitude and see the abundant blessings I have bestowed upon you. I have raised you up not only for your own benefit but to bless others through you and to let you experience true prosperity. There should be no room in your thoughts for doubt or complaints. Progress falters when you lack belief. Prosperity dims when you doubt my promises. Remember, you do not navigate this life by sight alone. You do not halt at hurdles. Embrace this journey with faith and let every step you take be filled with the assurance of my unfailing love and support. As we move forward together, let your heart be light, free from worries and doubts. For in my presence, there is a fullness of joy and paths of peace, even when you face barriers that seem insurmountable. When doors appear firmly shut and walls of iron rise before you, press onward. These obstacles will crumble by following my guidance. You are overcoming adversity. Victory lies ahead, ready to embrace you. Remember, your faith in me holds immense power. 
Your trust in my promises can bring about wonders. Believing in me is rooted in reality, not mere fantasy. I am your path and your life, a tangible presence within you. I am your almighty God, and I have endowed you with the strength to conquer, to move mountains, to heal ailments, and to lift the curses from your life. Your faith is directly linked to your triumph. Now is not the time for doubt. The moment is near when you will relish the victories I have promised. My commitment to you is profound, bound by both my love and my sacrifice. The universe may change, the skies and lands may fade, but my words to you will endure eternally. Hold fast to this promise as you move forward, fortified by the certainty that my love and power are ever-present, guiding you towards a future filled with blessings and achievements. Embrace my love warmly. Yield to my will with a heart full of love. Know that I cherish you deeply. As your sovereign God, I am intimately familiar with both your past and your future. These words I whisper to your heart come from a place of paternal care, urging you not to lose heart or surrender. Take yet another step forward in faith. Persist in your efforts. The chains that once restrained you have been shattered. The barriers to your joy are crumbling. Now is the moment to act decisively. You must not halt your progress. Lift your banner high and with all your might, sing your battle hymn. Approach this challenge with unwavering faith and determination. Fight valiantly like the champion you are meant to be. Should fatigue overtake you in this struggle, rest assured, I will fortify you. To those who listen and believe, I will make my presence and support clear. You will recognize my voice guiding you, even though times may seem tough and your family's situation challenging. Hold on to the promise of my blessed plan for you. You will rise above these unseen adversaries. Trust in my design. Your victory is on the horizon, crafted with the utmost love and care for you. As your adversaries tremble, they recognize their time is short. They witness your rise and Feel their strength waning. I urge you to lift your eyes and let a radiant, holy smile emerge. Allow me to anoint your head with the oil of joy, imbuing you with unshakable confidence. When you step out to meet the day, whether it's to school, work, a crucial doctor's appointment, or a momentous decision, approach each with steadfast faith. Fear no one. When the time comes to speak, stand firm. My powerful presence will envelop you, and the precise words you need will flow effortlessly from your lips, free from anxiety. I have endowed you with my spirit and the gift of self-control, ensuring your emotions align with my will. Therefore, whatever challenges you face, confront them with faith and bold assurance, because I am ever with you. I have not forsaken you, even when you were distant, and I protected you from harm when I was far from your thoughts. Now that you have dedicated your life to me, think how much more steadfast my care will be. Your journey is under my watchful eye, and with each step you are more secure in my love. I will reshape the cosmos to carve a path for you. Into your hands, I will place a radiant sword, and at its gleam your adversaries will scatter. You are courageous, and you are cherished. Tell me, do you still hold faith that I can perform profound miracles in your life? Those who oppose you will find themselves facing disgrace. I love you deeply, and I am flawless in my actions. I understand my purposes. Everything is orchestrated with intent. I will transform your trials into triumphs, and soon you will emerge victorious, bearing blessings so abundant that others will look on in awe. Defeat is not in your story, so trust in my assurances that brighter days are ahead. I will remain by your side 
and my intentions will unfold as they should. Do not be perturbed or disheartened by the negative forces that swirl around you, or by the threats of those who wish for your downfall. I emphasize this so you will always remember. No force can conquer you. I desire for you to possess immense faith, confident in the knowledge that your foes are already vanquished before they even attempt to strike. Yet stay vigilant against their schemes and guard your heart from negative emotions. Each morning, come to me in prayer, full of faith, and allow my love to envelop you, liberating your spirit from the fears that cloud your thoughts. Know in your heart that you will prevail, for I am with you. I am your God, your Heavenly Father, your Friend, your Creator, your Shepherd, your King, your Liberator. Do not lose heart, but continue to immerse yourself in my words. I will engrave my promises upon your memory, promises that soothe and heal your soul, reignite your zeal for life, Awaken your latent desires, and rejuvenate the splendid dreams I instilled in you from the beginning. As you walk with me, understand that I am actively shaping your journey. I am altering circumstances in your favor, removing barriers that block your path to success, smoothing the roads before you, and resolving many of the conflicts that stifle your growth. My dear child, Welcome me into your home today. Open every door and window of your life and let the sanctity of my blessing flow through, bringing healing to your soul and peace to your heart. I have already purified your space, breathing new life into every corner. With my voice, I have cleared the clutter of your thoughts, sweeping away the remnants of your past sufferings. You are now cleansed and forgiven. Remember, this does not mean you are without flaw or that you will never face temptation again. You are my child, and I cherish you dearly, but you are also human. The journey will continue, and you will persist in this struggle, holding tightly to my hand. Embrace the challenge of seeking me daily, loving me with all your heart and soul, and dedicating your entire life to me. In doing so, I promise always to be by your side ready to support you and help you advance, even if you stumble along the way. I know you don't sin intentionally. I understand that in battling your adversaries, you may sometimes fall. In those moments, they might mock and attempt to humiliate you, seeing you tarnished once again. But in those times, lift your eyes to me. I have sent you into this battle and it is my role to cleanse, strengthen, and forgive you anew. Persist despite any opposition. Your adversaries are relentless and unrepentant, driven by envy of the victory I cloak you in, and they will use every tactic at their disposal to undermine the confidence you feel today. But you hear my voice, you grasp my words, you love your family, and desire their success knowing well that this requires fighting, working hard, clinging to your faith, and believing in my promises. You will receive immense blessings, and your enemies are aware of this. They aim to thwart you. They once saw you as weak and never anticipated your turn to me, your admission of weakness and sin. That's precisely why I have decreed your forgiveness and prosperity. I am with you every day. No force will prevail against you. None will humiliate or overpower you. And should you fall, I will surely lift you up again. This is my unwavering promise. Your entire household, even those far away, will come to experience my presence in a profound and supernatural way. When days feel dreary and a heavy cloud looms over you, when you feel the urge to shout, to flee, to abandon everything, speak to me. Close your tearful eyes. Let me wipe your tears with my holy mantle. Hear my voice, but also share your heart. Speak without fear. Express your feelings openly. Do not worry that I will chastise you for your words. 
in such moments, it is your soul reaching out for me, seeking my presence, yearning to be filled with my love and understanding. My dear child, there are moments when the best thing you can do is find a quiet place, kneel down, and rest in my embrace. It's okay if you find yourself at a loss for words or if you prefer silence. Just be still, feel my presence, and recognize that I am your God, your Father, and your ever-faithful friend. I understand all that you've endured and how deeply you need to find rest. Know that I am always here, ready to replenish you with life, love, and peace. Come and experience this for yourself. Everything takes on new meaning and value when you spend time with me. Join me and bask in my love and affection. I'm the source of true peace and the one who can bring clarity to the challenges you face. I'm aware of each one and rest assured, nothing is beyond my control. I'm looking after you, but it's important for you to relax and let faith and trust rejuvenate your spirit. My child, my love for you is immense. You cannot fathom the depth of love I have ready to pour over you, to wash away the sorrows that have brought tears to your eyes. I'm here to heal you, to clear your mind and heart of confusion and the painful memories that weigh heavily on you. Come to me, my child. I'm the cure for your suffering. My love is so profound that it will help you realize that nothing in this world is more significant than our relationship. I am your creator, your provider, and I've never and will never leave your side. Feel my presence now and find solace in my love. I am currently soothing your heart. I hold you within my loving embrace and I promise never to let you fall. I love you immensely. Your future is filled with abundance. Lift your eyes and see the path ahead and meet it with bravery and resolve. Do not fear or falter. Accept your blessings with love and humility. Many hesitate to receive them, feeling unworthy or unprepared, letting opportunities slip by only to later lament that I have not answered them. But remember, with my sacrifice, your sins have been washed away. You carry an attitude of sincere faith. You have learned to love genuinely. This truth transforms and liberates. My love has deemed you worthy. Do not dwell on past mistakes. Do not concern yourself with the judgments of others when your heavenly Father has already forgiven you. If you have sought forgiveness and people have withheld it, if you've atoned for past mistakes and still face accusations, Leave these burdens to me. I will handle each person with justice. You may find it necessary to distance yourself from these accusers, even if they are friends or relatives. You are progressing, moving forward into your future, while they stagnate, bound to their failures. They had their chance to move on, but chose to ignore my call, indulging in folly, shamed by their association with me, preferring to please others rather than embrace my path. This is why they cannot support your growth. If you continue to surround yourself with such negativity, their bitterness and blame might drag you back into guilt for past deeds. I do not wish this for you. I want you to stand strong in your faith regardless of what others say. Make time each day to enter my presence. Don't miss our vital meeting. Even a few minutes from your busy day to listen to my guidance can transform your spirit. Commit to this practice. The strength I offer is crucial for you. You need my Holy Spirit every time you kneel. Surrender your will to me and dedicate your life to me. I will replenish you. You will find yourself in a realm where miracles happen, where pain turns to joy and sadness to happiness. Prepare your space, open your arms, clean and organize your home, for a bountiful harvest is on its way to bring immense joy to you and your family. Listen closely, just for a moment. Observe what I instruct. 
be strong and courageous. Do not fear or be dismayed, for I, the Lord your God, am with you wherever you go. This has always been true because of our mutual love. My presence in your life is your reward for loyalty. You haven't sought wealth for its own sake. Instead, you aim to break the chains of poverty and illness that bind your loved ones. You wish to spare them suffering. Your efforts, your dedication, your honesty and patience, none of these go unnoticed. You consult me in every decision. My word is ever-present, ready on your lips as you rise each day. For this, I grant you wisdom and strength, ensuring that all you undertake is prosperous and fruitful. You will experience supernatural abundance, which will also overflow to bless others. They will see you as a person of value, humility, and great wisdom. Remember these words. Be strong and courageous. Strive diligently. Embrace this renewal of spiritual fullness. Face whatever challenges arise and do not fear the fear itself. Behind those daunting emotions lie tremendous blessings that will bring plentiful provision. I am your omnipotent God. If you love me, you will trust in my promises. I don't deal in half measures. I will bless you abundantly. Even when you doubt your own courage, I am here to shift your perspective and remind you of your worth. For I've bestowed upon you the power to overcome great adversities, yes, even to trample scorpions and serpents underfoot. Rest assured, no harm will come your way because my spirit is your protector. Even on days when fatigue and ailment weigh you down, remember that in my presence you will find healing, comfort, peace, and refuge. You can always seek solace in my arms, for no matter how much you achieve or how far you go, you will always be my cherished child. I am forever ready to soothe your worries and envelop you in my love. Come boldly and confidently into my embrace to be fortified further. I love you deeply. Do not hold back your tears, for they are a testament to the deep emotions stirring within you like tumultuous waves crashing inside. We both understand that there are many storms raging in your mind and your soul feels weary. With me, you need not mask your feelings. Speak openly and honestly. Your sincerity is precious to me. Your tears are like those that wash my feet. When you cry out in your anguish, it moves me profoundly. You cry from pain from the overwhelming surge of emotions that shake your life unexpectedly. You cry when you are pushed to your limits, when you encounter insurmountable barriers and frustration halts your progress, compelling you to kneel in despair. You may feel defeated, but this is not true failure. Rather, it is the crucial moment of realization that only through my guidance can you overcome the barriers ahead. Today marks the beginning of your liberation. Embrace this day, for it is not just another moment. It is the dawn of your newfound freedom. Step forward with the knowledge that my love and power accompany you, transforming obstacles into pathways and sorrow into joy. Remember, in your weakest moments, my strength is made perfect. You no longer need to endure such deep humiliation or bear so much disdain. If you truly believe that once the King of Heaven walked this earth and endured unimaginable pain and suffering for you, if you believe that I sacrificed my life on the cross so you could be truly free and fully alive, then embrace the courage I am granting you today. Feel your spirit being healed by my power. Today, I bestow upon you the strength to rise and distance yourself from those things that bring you so much pain and suffering. Go forth with confidence to face the day. I fill you now with peace and resilience. No one can take this joy from you. If you wish to speak, I'm here beside you. If you need to come back into my embrace and cry, 
do not hesitate, for I will welcome you with open arms filled with my love. Give me your heart and your time. Place your desires and dreams in my hand. You may be overwhelmed with worry, but I urge you to calm down and absorb my words deep within your soul. I will not fail you, I promise. You have entrusted me with your life and loyalty. You have given me a significant place in your spirit. My words permeate your thoughts, reassuring you that your answers are near. Reflect on this. If I have never failed you before, why would I fail you now? My love for you grows each day sweeter than honey, more beautiful than any flower, more real than the sun that warms you by day. Consider those around you living in shadows of sadness and despair. I'm just as close to them. I knock on their doors. My voice calls out to them, yet they have grown weary of listening. Those who led them astray have failed them. They placed their trust in humans and now feel disillusioned, mistakenly thinking I have let them down too. They close their ears and reject my declarations of love, blaming me for the failings of others. But you, you listen to me, you call on me, and I assure you, I am right by your side. Our relationship is real and true. You understand that humans can fail and you do not compare me with them. When you face attacks, when people speak ill of you, reject and wound you, claiming I am punishing you, they will one day answer for their words before my holy throne. But now, focus on your eternity. Forgive those who harm you and look to me, your heavenly Father. Do not let your challenges and disappointments snuff out your faith or drive you away from me. I love you here and now, just as you are. Offer me your regrets and mistakes. I will cleanse your guilt and envelop you in my mantle of goodness. Together we will accomplish great things. Never question my perfect love. I loved you. I love you. And I will continue to love you forever. Tell me you believe me. This week you will demonstrate remarkable courage. You are called to lead your family forward, and you will indeed prevail with all your might. You will knock on every door and contend fiercely, for I am orchestrating all things, aligning situations and people exactly where they need to be. As you listen to me now, you will sense my power aiding you. Your victory is already secured. I have won it for you and will place it directly into your hands. However, it is essential that your faith is reignited. Continue to trust and, importantly, believe in yourself as well. You've endured insults and humiliation even from those within your family. Recognize that these attacks stem not only from malice but from envy as well. They see the unique spark within you and Know that something special resides in your spirit. Yet do not harbor grudges or entertain thoughts of vengeance. If this week brings unexpected challenges, if adversaries stand in your way, if your efforts to provide are met with stress, pray for those who seek to harm you. They desire to see you lose hope and abandon the progress you've made and the plans I have laid out for you. In response, I am dispatching a formidable legion of angels to confront your foes. Continue steadfastly, my child. Do not bow your head. My presence accompanies you, shielding you from harm and ensuring no defeat. Seek me in the morning, cry out in the night, and rely on my strength. I will journey alongside you, guard you at dawn, and stand with you as you rise to face each day. This week, I have decreed immense blessings for you and your family. The choice to believe and persevere or to retreat rests with you, but I know you well and I anticipate your decision. You will hold fast to my promise. At an unexpected moment this week, your victory will manifest. Should you need me, I am here. Approach confidently whenever you need to speak. 
my continued words and actions will affirm my deep love for you. You will emerge from any trial triumphantly and powerfully. As you pass through fires, you will not be scorched. No flame will burn you. When adversity arises, you will not drown in turbulent waters. No one can take your peace, your faith, or your blessing from you. Revisit this message whenever you need reassurance. These words are crafted to soothe your spirit and clear away the shadows that may loom around you. You have cried out, and I am responding. You've entered my presence at just the right moment, seeking clarity, and I am here to speak directly to you through my Holy Spirit to assure you of my attentiveness. Know that I've heard every word you whispered in solitude. You've expressed feeling overwhelmed, questioning the worth of your struggles, doubting if there's any reason to continue. Hear me clearly now. Do not be troubled by these thoughts. They do not anger me. I love you immensely, and what I hold for you is a love that is pure, powerful, and holy. Genuine, tender, solely yours, eternal, and unbreakable. No one can take this from you. I'm here to lift you from your despair, to demonstrate my love in such a profound way that you will feel its unique supernatural quality deep within your being, a sensation far surpassing any human emotion. This is not a fleeting flutter of the heart or a temporary sigh of relief. This love is healing, restorative, filling your mind and heart with enduring joy and peace. You will emerge from this ordeal with your head held high, carrying the demeanor of a victor, never again doubting your immense value, love, and protection. The scars of rejection may still pain you. Your spirit may reel from neglect, but understand you are a beautiful soul who was met with disdain when you deserved love and protection. Yet it is this very love for me that is transforming you, you grasp my hand, rise up, and begin a new journey on the right path, and you will not falter again. Ahead lies only success, happiness, freedom, and peace. Continue to fight, for you and your family are in my hands. I have the final say over your fate. Your task is to persevere, maintaining your dignity and refusing to yield to those who seek to degrade you. Recognize me as your sovereign God, your King, your Lord, and your Heavenly Father. You face a sea of challenges that seem poised to overwhelm you, but you must believe in my power and walk firmly over these turbulent waves. You will not falter. You will not drown. My hand is always extended for your rescue. When doubts assail you, cling tightly to me. You can always rely on me. I am forever by your side. Approach me with confidence, knowing I will never turn you away. I will guide you out of your troubles and lead you toward victory, even against the fiercest winds. I love you. My dear child, how wonderful it is to share this moment with you as you open your heart to my words. Prepare to be touched by a message that not only comforts, but also ignites a transformative peace within your spirit. Open your doors wide, allowing not only your ears to listen, but also your eyes to witness the unfolding of my truth in your life today. I'm here to speak of miracles, not just tales of old, but wondrous deeds unfolding in your life at this very moment. Believe with all your heart for these are not mere dreams, but the dawn of your new reality. As you embrace my words, know that each syllable is soaked in the power to heal and renew. These are significant times, and the air is thick with the tension of a spiritual battle. Forces of darkness array against you, attempting to sow seeds of doubt and distraction. Yet fear not, for I have commissioned legions of angels to guard you and guide your steps. Whether you come or go, remember my urging. Be strong and courageous. 
Do not succumb to fear or dismay, but hold fast to my teachings from the break of dawn until you return weary from the day's toil, yet victorious in spirit because you have stood steadfast for your loved ones and remained true to my call. As night falls and you lay down, weary yet hopeful, remember that the battle does not cease with the setting sun. Give me the moments before sleep, for even a few whispered prayers are a precious gift in my eyes. You may not fully comprehend the immense power of your prayer, but know this. Each word you speak in faith reverberates through the heavens, bringing forth abundant blessings. Never hesitate to proclaim my promises aloud, to declare my statutes boldly within your home. Let not mockery or misunderstanding deter you. Those who scoff only miss out on the profound blessings I have in store. Stand firm, speak with conviction, and know that in every word there is a blessing waiting to unfold. Speak these words with me now. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. Let these words resonate within you. Say them once more, but this time with greater vigor, full of faith and exuberance. These are not merely lines to be recited and forgotten. They are sacred utterances that, when spoken, kindle a fire within your heart, a fire that purges doubts, despair, and the destructive lies sown by adversaries. Lift your voice and declare with certainty, My God is my strength and my refuge. Whom shall I fear? The name of the Lord is a fortress, unbreakable and steadfast. Cry out to Him, and he will draw you into his embrace, comforting your soul, lifting you above the turmoil, and sheltering you beneath his wings. In his presence you are secure. Now, pause for a moment. To all who receive these words, take a step back, close your eyes, and deeply contemplate what you have heard. Allow each syllable to saturate your spirit, breaking the chains that bind you, whether they be addictions or ailments. Extend your hand toward me, rise and step forward. I am calling you into a realm beyond the ordinary, a supernatural space I have spoken of often where your future is forged and your blessings battled for. It is essential now more than ever to fortify your faith and immerse yourself in my word for soon you will witness and comprehend wonders beyond your imagination, mysteries previously unseen and unknown to you. You will experience the overwhelming magnitude of divine love that envelops you. Your heart will soar with joy each morning as my words greet you anew. Become attuned to this guiding voice, heed my counsel, and allow yourself to be led. As your loving Father, I reach out to you with a heart full of boundless love, desiring above all for you to find true peace. Today, proclaim liberty over your life. The burdens that weighed down your ancestors, their fears, jealousies, and confusions are no longer yours to bear. In my holy name and by the victorious power of my redeeming blood, I shatter the chains of these ancient curses. Every shadow of malice, every whisper of deceit that has darkened your family's history is dispelled now. You are liberated, truly free. I have purged your heart of all negative influences. Now let us not leave it vacant. Open wide the door of your heart and invite me in. Let my presence fill every corner of your being. Although the enemy has been vanquished, your spirit should never remain empty. Offer me the primary place in your life, devote your love and loyalty to me, and from this day forward, start anew. Others will soon take notice. Your countenance will shine with a newfound light, and your joy will be unmistakable. Believe in my words, for I am the Lord your God, your steadfast protector and savior. Today, I bestow upon you a special message crafted by the Holy Spirit 
meant to touch the very essence of your soul. Accept it with gratitude, engage in prayer with unshakable faith, and anticipate the wondrous acts I am about to unfold in your life. Ask yourself, who loves you so deeply? You know it is I, and you love me in return. Pause for a moment in your day to listen to my voice. It delights me to see your dedication to your family and the value you place on our relationship. I trust in you, knowing you will use wisely the blessings I provide. Unlike those who wander lost, unaware of the essential need for their families to know me, you have led your home in faith. My words resonate in your abode, a testament to the rightful place you have given me. Be assured, angels guard your dwelling, your focus on what truly matters, your family, peace, and enduring love will be forever blessed in all your endeavors, whether at work or in daily tasks, embody diligence and integrity. Let no harsh words pass your lips, words that might wound or tear down. Instead, be a vessel of forgiveness, moved daily by my presence. Just as surely as the dawn breaks, let your emotions find their rightful place, each flowing naturally into the next. Your days will be marked by courage, tranquility, enthusiasm, joy, and peace. These are not merely fleeting miracles, but the enduring rewards that flow generously from my throne to those who earnestly seek me. I am ever-present, not hidden or difficult to find. Though some claim to look for me and see nothing, when the scales fall from their eyes, they will see that I have always been right here before them. Feel my joy in you now. Your life brings me great pleasure, and I harbor no grievances against you. Look not at your past mistakes or imperfections. Do not be disheartened by the criticisms of those who might envy you. Stand firm, for you are imbued with strength and vitality. A myriad of blessings and new opportunities await, chances for you to serve and assist others. Your family and you are destined to be a source of joy and a blessing to many. Never cease to trust in me. Declare it boldly. I accept my blessing. I speak now to your resilient heart. Do not falter. Do not lose heart. Do not give in to doubt or fear. I am your shield, your strength, your closest friend. I am your Father, your God. Yes, I am your God. The blessings that come are reserved for the courageous. Arise, for today marks the beginning of your freedom. You have endured long seasons of sorrow. Your strength may have faltered, but through it all your bravery has shone brightly. You are my child chosen from the womb to thrive and to bestow blessings upon others. The enemy sought to ensnare you with his deceptive whispers, aiming to crush your spirit with the weight of untruths delivered through his agents of darkness. Your heart, pure and unassuming, once trembled under these threats, swayed by fear, yet deep within you burned a flame unexplainable and unwavering. At your lowest, when despair seemed your only companion, you heard my voice, tender and clear. I reached out to you, lifting you from the depths with a triumphant hand. You have seen my glory, the marvels and miracles I have unfurled in your life. Now, as you face these trials, rise up, stand with conviction, and let those who oppose you see that within your humility and simplicity, my greatness firmly resides. Engage fervently in prayer, embody my power. The blessings you seek, those beautiful desires of your heart, I will grant according to my perfect will. I am preparing you, strengthening you for magnificent endeavors soon to unfold. In these days, turn your focus towards seeking me and hearing my guidance. I am about to unveil your destiny and transform your life. 
watch closely, for it will happen soon. After hearing my voice today, feel the profound love I have for you. You need not walk in heaviness, nor should you lament your current trials. My love for you is palpable, and today you will experience it manifold. I will manifest it to you. Declare it through my mighty word. Should anyone try to unsettle you, you will feel this divine love surge within you. If sorrow tries to grip you, my embrace will enfold you, dispelling all distress and filling your heart with unending joy. You and even your friends will marvel at the change. They will witness your happiness. Your adversaries will retreat, defeated and dismayed, as they realize their inability to instill fear or pain in you. Surrounding you is a divine fortress of protection, an invisible yet unbreakable barrier where angels stand guard over your home day and night. Trust this with all your heart, for the love I hold for you is profound and real, as tangible as the air you breathe. It surpasses any miracle you could request, enveloping and sustaining you. This love is your greatest blessing, and your thankful heart delights me immensely. Each morning as you wake and give thanks for your life, entrusting your days and destiny into my hands, you embody faith. While some may scoff at your belief in an unseen, omnipotent God, you know the truth of my presence and my watchful care over you. Stand in this faith. Live out each day with the assurance that you are a cherished child of the Creator of the universe. Secure in every step, your face aglow with joy. My child, your steadfast gratitude and the purity of your heart move me deeply. Know that tomorrow and every morning I await to greet you with my love. Even before the dawn breaks, I am always here for you. If you seek escape from your current troubles, listen closely today, and you will receive the solutions directly from me. You may perceive your situation as complex, but remember you have already entrusted your life and heart to me. I have imbued you with my spirit, affirming that nothing is beyond my reach. Believe, declare, and proclaim with all your might. Nothing is impossible for God. Embrace this truth wholeheartedly. My promises are active and potent. They go forth to heal and transform, never returning void. Though change may seem slow, remember you are the progeny of the Almighty. It's time to transform your thinking urgently. My Holy Spirit resides within you, carrying divine power. Miraculous outcomes await when you speak my words with love. Show kindness to others, temper your reactions, and cease harsh words towards those you love. I'm opening your eyes to wonders, answering your cries with glorious revelations. Engage with my word daily. Listen intently. Open your Bible. Understand that you have access to a supernatural realm where you are continuously loved, safeguarded, and guided by your Heavenly Father every moment everywhere, whether in joy or in distress. Always remember I am with you, and my promise stands firm in my word. Yet understand this crucial truth. Your spirit and my spirit are intertwined, bridging the gap between the natural world and the miraculous. You stand in this world where challenges and conflicts are inevitable. Adversaries may rise against you, attempting to cause harm, but know that these trials cannot defeat you. You are backed by my support, fortified by my word, and endowed with the strength of a champion. Your steadfast faith is your greatest asset. Stand up now. Confront your challenges with boldness. I cherish you deeply and am continually strengthening you. Affirm your belief in me. Shout it. Write it. Nothing is impossible for God. Remain calm. You will not be disgraced. Everything will be all right. I do not abandon those I love. 
no one will mock or scorn you in your trials. I will not permit it. Those who oppose you challenge not just you, but me. Do not fear. Your life is secure. However, be wise and do not react as your enemies anticipate. They provoke you only to see you stumble. If they threaten, pray. If they shout, pray. If they conspire, come and kneel before me. Your faith has great power. When decisions loom before you, seek my counsel. If uncertainty about the future unnerves you, remember that I hold your destiny and your family's destiny securely in my hands. No one can harm you. Be strong and courageous. When you feel cornered, reject fear. Do not let your emotions rule you. They often deceive. I have assured you repeatedly, you are immensely precious to me. Hold on to this truth during the fiercest moments of your struggles. You are invaluable to me, more precious than millions of diamonds. Nothing material can match your worth in my eyes. Believe in my words and embrace your identity as my beloved child, redeemed, cleansed, and transformed by my grace. Although the adversary may hurl reminders of past errors, these accusations hold no weight. I have forgiven you, and I no longer recall your past missteps. No one, regardless of their status or your respect for them, has the right to condemn what I have forgiven. Remember, you are forever liberated from the past by my love. Receive my word, kneel, and persevere in believing. Do not be discouraged. You are not alone. I know you love me. I know you believe me. A wonderful blessing is about to arrive. Receive it because you deserve it for the faith you have shown. You have strived and been brave. And despite so many problems, fear has not defeated you. You are a person of great valor and unbreakable character. Only the sweetness of my love and my holy affection can touch you and make you cry. You have such spiritual sensitivity. You know when my presence surrounds you and detect the spiritual enemies that come to wage war against you. But in front of them, your knees do not tremble. You are not a coward, nor do you run away like others do. That is why what is coming is great. The blessings you are about to receive are enormous. I love you, and I have shown it to you many times, in difficult days, in bitter moments. In those nights when I caressed your heart with divine consolation, and the next day your spirit had grown, you had strengthened, and you could clearly see your wonderful purpose and beautiful destiny. Because of your steadfast faith, I am sending showers of revival upon you and your family. Now is the time for healing. To come into my presence and lay down all grievances, all bitterness. This is the moment for reconciliation, to set aside differences and embrace a beautiful restoration. If you are willing to receive this blessing, let me work through you, granting you wisdom that will fortify your character and help you guide those you love with my word. Many are reluctant to follow me, but they will reconsider when they witness the transformation wrought by my love and power in your life. Do not be afraid to be a vessel for my purposes. You will not face disgrace. If anyone mocks you or seeks to trouble you, respond with dignity, and I will handle the rest. Banish complaints from your speech. Nourish your soul with my wise commandments. Immerse yourself in my word and cherish your own worth as I cherish you. Extend the same patience to your family and others that I have shown you. Act now, and soon you will witness the miracles you have longed for. Even those with the most challenging dispositions will change. Those who have strayed will find their way back to your home when they return, let them see in you a model of approachability and love. Ensure they know they can draw near without fear of rebuke or judgment. 
embrace them like the prodigal returning home, repentant and seeking solace. Go out to meet them, receive their tears with open arms, offering a gentle and warm embrace. Strip away the remnants of their past mistakes and clothe them in love and forgiveness, even if you disagree with their past actions or choices. <laughs> 